about you, but I'm feeling ready for Christmas. It's the most wonderful, wonderful time, time of, of the year. year. Indeed, and we do have some excellent events coming up that we've that we love for you to join us for here at Riverside Church. I'm excited. Of course you are. To start with, we're joining in with the toys for Birmingham. Initiative to collect new gifts gifts for children that will then be distributed across Birmingham for families in need to come and collect this Christmas. What kind of toys? Here's the list. We'll be accepting the toy donations at Riverside House from the 14th of November and then um, do one big drop off on the 10th of December. Which is also the day that Riverside Performing Arts are doing public performances of their Christmas show, The Giant Christmas Adventure. Sounds great. Now for our Sunday services. On the 4th of December we'll have an online only reflective ad advent service at 10am followed by our, our in-person only Christmas extravaganza at Tally Hub. There will be a choir, dancing, drama and it, will, and it will be lots of fun. Then on the 11th of December it's our Christmas generation service at Riverside House. Will there be any Chris Tingles? Of course, a normal service at 10am, live streamed, and then a more in attractive walkabout experience at 4pm for families looking for something more accessible and multi-sensory. And on the 18th of December is our Christmas carol service in the morning and evening. You should invite your family and friends. I do love mince pies. I hope we have some. I don't. Christmas cake as well. Gross. You're forgetting about the main event, the whole reason for the season. Christmas, Christmas Day! Exactly! Well, we've got a 10am service at Riverside House, which will be fun for everyone. And it's followed by a free Christmas Day open lunch. Everyone is welcome to join. Then, we'll have the confusing week, where everyone forgets what day of the week it is. And some pyjama days. After that, we'll have a new Year's Day online only service of reflection to help us take stock as we enter 2023. What does take stock mean? It's like, is it like chicken stock? No, like to review or assess everything that's been going on so we can give thanks to God and make an exception plan for the year to come. Sounds amazing. Go to our website to find out more about um, all of the events that we've mentioned. See you there!